Today is the day, ladies. We're going to break the code to find the keywords to express your true, authentic, personal style. If we haven't met yet, I'm Ifat, a fashion designer and a personal styling coach. In this channel, I'm sharing with you practical tips how to find confidence in your style again, how to feel and look at your best every single day. If you're interested in this topic and you haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll be notified every time I post a new video. Hi lovely ladies! Have you ever felt unsure how to express your authentic true style throughout clothing? Well, in today's video, I'm going to share with you easy ways how you can crack this code and find your keywords to help you express your true authentic style. Because the way we dress, it has a huge impact the message we share with the world. Clothes, it's not about fashion. It's a way for us, it's a tool for us to tell a story about ourselves, to express our true personal style. We want to find a way or keywords to really understand the energy or the vibe that we want to create. So the people around us, the world, when they see us, they'll have a sense who we are. Our style is our DNA and we all have style. The only question is if it's expressed or not. When you not express your true personal style, what's happened, your body language change, your mood is changed, you know, you, your body language change and you kind of shrink yourself, you feel insecure. It's happened for all of us. I'm sure that, you know, when you try to figure out what is your personal style, it's happened for me in the past when I saw somebody else an outfit which I thought, wow, it looks so good on them. Like, I want to wear it too. I want to try it out, right? And I bought, I bought like some kind of like business formal outfit look. And the moment I put it and I wear it the whole day, I felt insecure. It didn't feel like me. It just felt too formal. It really didn't allow me in my personality. And I couldn't wait for the moment I could... I can change this outfit, like go home and change it. It just, it just didn't feel good, right? It, it wasn't me. So it's very, very important that we we'll understand what is the key words that really describe who we are, our personality. Clothing are tools to help us communicate with the world, to make us feel good about ourselves, to make us feel confident, to make us feel happy. And it's almost, it, it, it's not almost, it's our skin. Think about it. Whatever you put from the outside, the dress, it needs to be your skin. It needs to be aligned with your soul, with who you are. Okay, so let's dive into it and crack these codes. What are some quality in you that you want that others will see it as well, that the world will see it when they look at you, even before they even start talking with you, when you see you in the street, when you start a Zoom meeting with your client, how, what impression do you want that they will get from your appearance, okay? So one way to start digging and find out, searching for those answers, you want to start looking perhaps in magazine, think about celebrities or, you know, movies or TV shows that you watching and you like the, you know, the actor that you really like and you feel like that you could be her best friend. What is the energy? What is like your best friend? What is the energy or quality that you like about them? Because what you like about them, it's the energy that you like about yourself, that it's inside yourself because you connected to these people, right? It's you find this quality about yourself. That's why you gravitate to them. For me, for example, my four keywords that I'm every single day when I'm dressing up, I have to have it in my appearance. When I create my outfit, I have to have it. Otherwise, I don't feel myself. Something is missing. I feel insecure. I just can't step outside the house without having those four keywords. And they are bold. And what is, if we're breaking down the category of bold, it's mean 
colors, bright colors, daring, it's mean sophisticated, it's mean patterns. So I really need to have those elements, those keywords, this energy in my outfit every single day. The second one will be sexy. When I'm dressing up, I like to feel attractive and sexy. So this is when I create this outfit. I need to have this element, this energy, this vibe in my outfit. Third key word is splendor. Splendor is one of the words of the meaning of my name, if at. And it's something that I need to have as an element, as a vibe, as my, in my energy when I'm dressing up. I like to feel splendor when I'm dressing up. So this is definitely will be my third keyword and the fourth it's originality. I like to feel original when I dressing up as well original if we break it down this word it's like mean artsy it mean organic original creative maybe as well the fact that I'm a fashion designer I really like to feel organic and original and artsy so this is what will describe the originality when i dressing up i definitely dress in a classic way boho and sometimes other style i don't like to stick to one label one style but the most important for me is to have this energy words that it doesn't matter which style i feel like at the day to dress up those elements will be in every single of the outfit so the keywords perhaps to describe your personality your vibe your energy when you're dressing up maybe it's effortless if we break down effortless it means it's outgoing it's chill relax so maybe this is the vibe that you want to have when you create an outfit every morning part of your personality that you want to express throughout your clo clothing is to feel comfortable so maybe you want to wear more neat fabric maybe you want to dress in an edgy way because this is aligned with your personality or you want to dress in more feminine way so you want to start dig in and ask yourself those questions what is the quality what is the the personality who I really am inside that I really want to express it outside so the second way to find out and crack the code what is your personal style go to Pinterest or to a magazine Pinterest is really great way I really really love to go to Pinterest because you can find anything there you start look you know start looking what you see and I want that you find what you gravitate to all the thing that you gravitate in the outfit that you gravitate to put them, create a library and put them inside this library. So the next step, what I wanted to do, I wanted to take a pen and a notebook and we're going to take all those outfits that you like, that you was gravitated to, you saw them in Pinterest and you create a library and add them to your library. We're going to break it down to details, okay? So I wanted you start dig in and start writing everything that come in your mind what is this outfit make you feel what is the vibe or the energy that you get sense from this outfit maybe it's cool maybe it's chic maybe it's feminine maybe it's uh, bold maybe it's artsy maybe it's preppy whatever it's feel like if it's by style if it's classy preppy bow whatever but as well the energy okay maybe it's something about the texture that make you feel some things or as well maybe you gravitate to outfit that have few different style maybe the blouse is more edgy and the pants is more have more relaxed feeling to it or more classy so write it down what is in in the outfit or what what do you like in this outfit maybe the mix of those two elements or the two styles together so you just want to write as much as you can all those details because this is will help you again narrow it down sweet ladies so now when you know the ways to crack the code I wanted to start and applying it it's such a fun process so when you do it write me the keywords that you describe that you crack to express your personality so much for watching this video if you haven't subscribed yet hit the subscribe button and please share my channel with your friends 
It means the world to me. I'm going to see you in my next video. Bye!